Well, we're just lately making this the Whit Merrifield show. He gets the job done again tonight with the first career triple, first career home run. The ovation a little bit different than it was in Chicago yesterday with 31,000 plus. But before I ask you about that, I want to ask you about the job of your pitcher, Edinson Volquez, and all the staff getting those double plays. Eddie was unreal. He struggled a little bit early, but man, he's a battler, and I'll tell you in a minute. That was the orange Gatorade. Yes, it is. I, I know how it goes. Okay. And the chant down in the dugout suite is two hit wit. But back again to the pitchers and getting those key double plays and Volquez tonight. Eddie was, Eddie was unreal. He struggled early. Um, but man, the, he, the guy battles and he, uh, he worked his way out of it and had an unbelievable game. And, uh, you know, he was. He was untouchable tonight. When kids are young, they are taught to run hard no matter what. I'm wondering what you were thinking on that triple there and if it was going to get through Chisholm Hall or not. Yeah, I knew I hit it pretty good, and then I saw him break in, so I thought I had a chance to get over his head, and um, once I got over his head, I knew I was either going to be on third base or Rusty was not going to be happy with me. <laughs> All right, so no home run on that one, but you took care of that in the – Two at bats later. Actually, almost had another one with the collision in center field. But tell us about the home run. I was thinking about bunting. I'm glad I didn't. <laughs> but uh, yeah, he he threw a curveball and left it up, and I got the barrel on it, and it was pretty cool. Good thing you didn't bunt. Congrats on the first home run. More importantly, the win tonight. Thanks, Whit. Thanks, Joe. Whit Merrifield. Safe to say, guys, and for good reason. The crowd absolutely loves him.